previously on Yu-Gi-Oh! Nightmare Troubadour. Platinum 14 watched as these two awesome competitors, Yugi and Kaiba, faced off in the semi-final round. And he also freed Joey from the Shadow Realm by defeating Yami Bakura once and for all. Now, it's in the finals, and Yugi and Flood are trying to do their best in order to defeat each other. Will Flood Mod 14 be able to win the final duel of the tournament? Find out right now on Yu-Gi-Oh! Nightmare Troopador. Alright guys, and so we were in the middle of side decking here. We won the first match last episode, but uh, yeah. We're up against Yugi again, best two of three, so even if we lose, it's okay. We can try once more. Epic final battle. Satin Gun, come out, attack mode. I am my turn. Ah, Yugi, don't you know? A card like that's a dime a dozen. I summon my own Sandman, but I'm gonna set two mysterious cards. I end my turn, Yugi. <laughs> I learned a little something else from Kaiba that I want to show you. But in order to do that, I need to end my turn. Ready? I play this card now, Yugi. Get ready. It's time to destroy all the powerful monsters in your hand, your deck, and your graveyard. I activate Crush Card Virus by tributing Sandman. Ooh, polymerization. Ooh, say goodbye to your skilled dark magician. Oh no. All right, so we got two cards out of this hand. Not bad. And that's not the best part. With, Sand with the combo by tributing Sandman, I can add another monster to my hand. So I think I'll take this one, Yugi. Guardian. Sam, attack. Joke's on you, Yugi. I've got another trap, and I'm not afraid to use it. Call the Honda will revive the same man I attributed for Crush Card Virus. I see. A good combo for you. I'll attack with my Celtic Guardian instead. Alright. That means I get to use Sam Yan's effect again, then. So what I'll grab this time, probably Morphing Jar. That's probably pretty good. Um, uh, let's see. Yeah. I could have also taken a copycat there. That probably would have been pretty good. And this turn, I think I'll throw Giant Germ into his sand hand. Alright. Germ. Dust Tornado. Kind of glad to see that card. Honestly, that almost changes my mind because we know he's only got one face down. So I'm going to set two cards. And I'm actually going to just set Giant German set. Yeah. That way I don't run into like Mirror Force or something, you know? What you got, you? Oh, Magical Huts. Not bad. Celtic Guardian, destroy that monster. I'll destroy his face down card. The the one we don't know about right there. All right. Now my germs duplicate. <laughs> Alright, such a good card. Such a good card. How you guys doing today, by the way? Uh, today is July the 22nd, 2023. Yep, pretty good. By the way, I've been looking at the recent amount of... Uh, Subscribers. So here in July, like at the fourth, we oh we hit a scapegoat. Good, good, good. Uh, yeah, we actually started at like uh, it was like close to 200 or so on the sub count. Uh, but yeah, now we're like man, we're already at like uh, like 220 now. It's crazy. But uh, yeah, I really appreciate you guys. You know, uh, with all the you know subscribing and stuff lately, or if you're commentating, make them a lot more comments than usual too. So. Or just watching the videos in general. The views in general have been, you know, slightly higher too, so. But yeah, thank you. Uh, you know, appreciate you guys. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna keep trying to make some more content for you guys. Alright, what you gonna get with Sand Game? Uh, you mean? Right. He'll probably play Magical Hats on his uh, 
big shield gone. That makes sense. Alright, so... Go, X-Head Cannon, Double Cannon Barrel Blast. Uh, wait, what? What's it asking me? Uh, no. Oh, he didn't play Magical Hats. That's interesting. Interesting choice, Yami Yugi. Interesting choice. Let's see if it pays off, I guess. Alright. Because we know that's what he's got face down, so... I wonder why he didn't play it there. Hmm. Alright. Whatever. Alright. And, uh... I am my turn. What you gonna do, Yugi? I draw. Dedication through light and darkness. Set two cards and in my turn. I'm guessing you set dedication face down. Uh, okay, we're good. All right, so we know he's got big shield guard. Now, so what should we do about that? Well, I think here's what we do. Um, honestly, I'm just gonna summon tribe and attack into it. Yeah. Okay. So let's. Uh, actually, we can afford to take some damage. Well, no, no, no. Maybe he's saving magical hats for this. So let's try this. Yeah, it is a big show guard now. Okay. Because it'll switch to attack mode. Then maybe he'll use it if I attack with giant germ. Let's see. He didn't use it. Wow. What is he waiting for? I don't know. He definitely should have used it right there, though. Interesting, you. Interesting. <laughs> What's funny is to start these uh, uh, expert cup. I was using a magical hat deck, and you know, with my experience with the card, Yugi, I would definitely say you misplayed right there. I mean, yeah, there's a chance my giant jump could hit it again, but at least I would take the damage. You know, I draw. I'll summon. I'll activate Souls of Revealing Light. This will halt your attacks for three turns, just like I did against Kaima. Alright, Yugi, alright. I end my turn. I draw. Not bad. Um... I think... I think I'll just summon Jinzo. Next turn I'll play Morphin Jar. Yeah. Alright, Yugi, take this. One of Joey's cards. Jinzo. Alright. And with that, I end my turn. Oh, whoops. There we go. Alright, guys. Well, if we can win this duel, we'll win the Expert Cup. I wonder what's going to happen if we do. Hmm. One more face down. Go ahead, Flood. Alright. Make sure I set everything properly here. Okay, I don't mind discarding Horse Raider, so I'll set this. This honestly is going to help out Yugi quite a bit, because he's got four cards face down, but I've got Jinzo, I'm not too afraid of his traps, so... Alright, go ahead, Yugi. I draw. I activate the magic card, Pot of Greed. This lets me draw two cards. And now, I'll activate another magic card. Graceful Charity lets me draw three. And just call it two. Alright, Yugi's going ham here. He's going ham. Go, Breaker, the magical warrior. When this monster's summoned, it gains a spell counter. And then I can remove it to destroy one of your spells or traps, Floyd. So I'll destroy that one. Spell absorption. Now you won't be gaining any more life points. Go, attack his face down. Yugi! ran into this monster. It's quite a special one. Morphing Jar. Its special effect will make us discard every card in our hand and redraw a new hand of five cards. Ooh, two Night Assailant. Nice, nice. We got Delinquent Duo, too. I end my turn. Alright, he's got one more turn on his swords, so we can't attack. I'll activate Delinquent Duo, Yugi, to discard a couple cards from you. Alright, let's see what all we've been discarding from him. Ooh, we got rid of that. Okay, good. So, we discarded, uh, wow, Dark Magician Girl. Uh, wow, yeah, 
has some good cards. Ooh, we discarded Skull Arch. I'm surprised he has this card. It's like the Summon Skull Restrain. Rope of Spirit, and this. Yeah, good cards, good cards. All right, let's just set this. And I'll end my turn there, Yugi. Go ahead. Your swords are now vanquished by my draw. I'll summon the skill, Dog Condition. Now it's time for some attacks. Breaker, attack. Destroy that one. Big mistake, Yugi. Remember my duel with Yami Bakura? He taught me to put this card in my deck. All right. It's so cool we're using so, so many cards from like the different characters in the finals here. Go, still slash. All right. That way I saved my XF cannon, Yugi. Not bad, Flood. I'll end my turn. All right, let's see if we can wrap this up. Go, Lashin, the mystical genie of the lamp. <laughs> All right, get ready, Yugi. Get ready, buddy. Now, XF cannon, go. Double cannon, barrel blast. All right. Go, Karibo, protect my life points. Big mistake, Yugi. You should have saved your Karibo for this attack. Go, Jinzo! Cyber Energy Shock! Nice. It looks like we're all clear, guys. So, yeah, with that, the Expert Cup has been defeated. And, yeah, looks like the prize is ours. Ooh, can I shrink something to 700? Uh, it doesn't look like it, no. Alright. Finish this duel, Tribe Infecting Virus. Yeah, you really should have saved that Karibo, bro. Alright, well, guys, we did it. We did it. We defeated Yugi in the final match. to level up. Sweet. Alright. Not too many points there, but it's okay. Ah, oh, Flood. I never imagined you would be this skilled. Thank you, Yugi. That means a lot coming from you. Thanks, bro. I tried my best. Not only have I felt the strength of your deck, but I also felt your dueling spirit. Thank you, Yami Yugi. Thank you. Ah, yeah. You did it, buddy. Yeah. Way to go. That was a tough match. Yeah, you actually beat you. I can't believe it. Congratulations, Flood. Thanks, guys. And I'm glad you're okay, Joey. Uh, fine. Flood. You've earned the title as the new King of Games, as much as I hate to admit it. But I'll be taking that title from you someday. Hey, yeah, hey, hey. <laughs> yeah, but you won't hold it for long. <laughs> That's funny, he, he, he said that. I, that line I basically just said, uh, the victory ceremony starts slowly. I think he means shortly. Hey man, let me get a steam refund on this. Slowly? Let's return. Okay. All right, what's gonna happen here? The winner of the Expert Cup is Flood and Mod 14. The champion is the new king of games. Here's your grand prize. First, you receive 2,000 Kaibakor points. Holy smokes, that's a lot. Also, as a special gift, you are now permitted to use the password machine. Oh, okay. I did it. I won the Expert Cup. And I'm the king of games now. You've got a card of level up. Ooh, Silent Magician level 8. Ooh. Magician's Cross. You got a card list of Expert Cup this victory pack. You got a deck recipe, holy crap, of Expert Cup Champ 1. Expert Cup Champ 2? Nice. Alright guys, and with that, I think we're going to be heading home here. Nice. And with that, guys, the Expert Cup is now over. And we are the new King of Games. Floodmon 14, King of Games, baby. Huh? I have mail. Okay. Uh, congratulations on winning the Expert Cup. You have earned the right... Oh, okay, so it's the same thing about the password machine. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, you can only use the password machine for cards that are in your card list, so... Yeah, and you can only put one password for each card, so... Uh, this is... 
This is an important message for all duelists using Duel Disc until now your Duel Disc were incapable of using forbidden cards. Starting today, we have removed this limit. You are now ooh, allowed to have one forbidden card in your deck, so we recommend reconstructing your deck. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, guys, well, with that, I'm going to save here. And, uh, yeah, let's take the advice that we just got there. Let me also make sure there's no other new mail real quick. But I think I'm going to add uh, a pretty good card to one of my decks that I've been wanting to add. Uh, yeah, so there's the two mails. Uh, yeah, so there you go. About the uh, password machine and stuff. Um, so let's... Let's edit one of our decks really quick. And it's just going to be a quick edit since we can add a forbidden card. So, actually, I'm going to add it to this deck, too, while I'm thinking of it. Uh, it's Witch of the Black Forest. Yeah, pretty good forbidden card that we haven't been allowed to use, but it definitely helps a lot of our strategies. So, I'll add that here in this deck, in the Lobster Soldier. Uh, and I'll take a look at my forbidden cards between episodes. But there is one deck I've really been wanting to try to pull off the combo with. And it is, and which will definitely help us out, it is, uh, I think it's this, no, it is this deck, I think. Yeah, Countdown with the XYZ uh, monsters in it. Yeah, so which can search out uh, X Head Cannon, which is the biggest problem sometimes is you can't find that, so yeah, let's add, uh, oh, we have a fusion piece we can add, okay. There we go. Oh, yeah, we can add another X Head Cannon. Which, which, which? There we go. I guess I'll make sure there's enough wide dragon heads and stuff while we're here. Uh, why? Wait, did we already pass Y? I think we did. Uh, X, Y, and Z. Did we pass Z? I think we did. Yeah, okay, okay. So I must have all of the ones I need in here. Uh, so where's Y? V, W, X. I'm just double checking this. X, Y. Okay, we do have three Y. Okay, and Z. Okay, okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Just wanted to make sure. After whoa, whoa, whoa. after uh, yeah, after uh, <laughs> seeing that we need another X. So yeah, we'll add this to the uh, what the heck is the power of unity? No, it is the uh, countdown deck. I guess we'll go to bed and see if anything happens when we wake up here, so, yeah. Alright, let's see what happens now that we are the new king of games. Sleep again. Alright. Awesome. And that, that was that was fun doing the Expert Cup. It's morning. Though the Expert Cup has ended, there are still many duelists with dual discs in the city. True, true. I guess this is me talking to myself. No one wants to stop dueling. Awesome. Okay, so I, I guess we'll just, you know, keep on dueling. Alright. So let's save. And I guess we'll do like one morning duel. Actually, you know what? Let's head to the uh, shop and see if there's any new packs, actually. Yeah, because we got a ton of Kaiba Corp points from the tournament. So, yeah, I definitely want to check here. Yeah, let's go here. Alright guys, wish me luck. But if there aren't any new packs, I'm just going to open some some of the older ones. Uh, let's see. Uh, this doesn't look like... Oh, there is one. Beautiful Challenger. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's start opening some of this. Okay, sweet. Alright, let's see what we get here. I can change back to small screen. Harpy Lady 2, Hunting Ground. Fusion Storm or Summy Blade. That's going to be pretty good in that, um, the, uh, you know, kind of warrior I deck. I've got with the Tomb Goblin Attack Force and stuff. Oh, another new pack, Wonder Sorcery. Okay. Oh, we got two new packs, it looks like, after the Expert Cut. Cool. Double Snare. Demotion. UFO Turtle. Some Buyer of the Dark. Okay. Okay, let's buy this one. This one's got Guild for the Lightning on the cover, that's cool. A scapegoat, okay. Is that our first scapegoat? Royal Magical Lab with Skill Drink, whoa. These are some good cards. Yeah, that's our first copy of Scapegoat, sweet. Sweet, I like Scapegoat. And it's not limited in this game. Wow, we have 6,000 Kaiba Corp, totally crap. 
All right, definitely good idea to come up. Reversal quiz. Oh man, there's some funny stuff I could do with that. Mama Grizzly, I like. Very good. Is that our first Mama Grizzly? Ooh, it is. Man, there's some good cards in this pack. Hell yeah. All right. Okay. So I know to definitely keep buying this pack because it seems like some battle floaters are in here. Uh, that's a good card. Last warrior from another planet. Okay. I think we'll buy one more of this pack. We'll call it good. Mama Grizzly, good. Hmm, actually, we still haven't found the ultra in this pack, the ultra rare, so I guess I'll buy a, a, a couple more until we do. Yeah, because there should be like one ultra, two super rares. Mask of the Accursed is pretty good. Uh, UFO Turtle. Emergency Provisions, okay. So that's super rare. Oops. So we'll buy this one. Alright. And we got plenty of copy core points, so. Uh, nice. New packs, I love it. New cards. Royal Magical Library is definitely probably going to go in my Exodia deck in between episodes. Marauding Captain's pretty good. Um, yeah, so there should still be an Ultra Rare in this pack, so let's do it. Marauding Captain's good, though, and I'm glad we got two Royal Magical Libraries. Um, oh! Reflect Bounder. Not bad. Not bad. We're an Ultra Rare. Okay. Yeah, and this is like a Magic Cylinder on legs, basically, so let's see if there's any other new packs. Uh, no, no, no. Just these two, but still, that's good. This is a very good pack. Uh, let's keep testing this one. Turtle. Huh. We basically pulled the St. Joan fusion there. <laughs> yeah, we got uh, both of the pieces. Um, yeah, Marie the Fallen One and um, uh, yeah, uh, uh, Marie the Fallen One and uh, Forgiving Men. Yeah, they're St. Joan. Nice. We pulled the whole fusion line. Hell yeah. All right. Okay, so let's see. I think I'll buy like Maybe just one more, and we'll call it good on the pack mine. So yeah. All right, a lot of interesting strategies for me to try later. Swift Guy of the Fierce Knight, not bad, not bad. Fairy Box is also pretty good. And certain like stall decks, uh, one more, and we'll, we'll call it good, we'll call it good. Yeah, we'll leave our, our Kyber Core points at 49. Spiritual, oh, Desqualla, that's good. I was wondering where to get that. Ooh, Slate Warrior, very good card. But yeah, I was wondering where to get this because Mokuba's had it for the longest time. And this is our first time getting access to it? That's crazy. All right, well, let's head on out, guys. Pretty productive day of buying cards. We got some really good ones. Very excited to uh, switch up our decks a little bit. All right, but I think we'll save here. All right, and we'll try out my new deck here. I assume like the normal morning people will still be out here, so we might face like someone like uh, Serenity or uh, oh wow, someone's right by my house. Uh, okay. Um. Oh. Okay. NPC. There's Mokuba. trying to face people we just haven't registered at this point um yeah that's the main thing um so but out of these three i guess i don't play grandpa that often so i guess we can go dual hill oh there's someone here unless we find someone new that we haven't registered here so oh it's Mako. okay so all people are registered uh yeah let's go for grandpa let's go for grandpa hi grandpa how you doing all right and so we'll duel him and that'll probably be the end of the episode I heard you're making quite a name for yourself and that you're the king of games, but the only way to know how good you really are is to do me. Let's do it. Let's do it. Grandpa, Ancient Pharaoh, countdown. All right. All right, wish me luck, guys. Hopefully we'll be able to pull off a XYZ Dragon Cannon. So that's the main combo of this deck. All right. Go ahead, Grandpa. All right. Nice hand, nice hand. And we got, yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. You see how we got Witch to search X-Head? 
And we already have Y, so that's good. That's really good. Alright, but to start, I think I'll play Giant Germ, just to thin the deck, you know. And, um, yeah, I'll set two face downs. Go ahead, Grandpa, go ahead. I am my turn. Alright. I can play Robin Goblin right here. Yeah. Okay. Alright, I'll draw. Foolish Burial, good. So let's send us. Well, ooh, I can even send X Head and revive it with Soul Resurrection. That sounds good. That sounds like a plan. Yeah. Yeah, or Cybertech. Or Cybertech. Uh, let's send X Head Cannon. It's coming together, guys. It's working. All right, uh, let's summon Witch of the Black Force in case he has trouble. Okay, now, giant germ. All righty, Grandpa. I'll attack you with my giant germ first. Or deal with a traveler. Yeah, he does like this card. I guess we'll choose monster, but uh, yeah, okay, okay. He's got one piece of it here. All right. Attack with Witch. Man, it feels so good to be playing uh, Witch of the Black Forest. So, Monster? Uh, wait, what? Uh, okay. There we go. Monster. It is. Oh, yeah, Swarm of Scarabs. That's dangerous. Okay. Well, we have to attack and uh, destroy that next turn. But we, it's clear to attack because all he has is monsters right now. So, that's good. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad he didn't set that first turn. So, or that last turn. So, scary. What you got, Grandpa? Right, gonna take that back. That's another monster, though. Honestly, I don't know if you should do that if you're running Ordeal of a Traveler, but that's pretty good. Assume it's swarm and attack with witch. Attack. Right. Ordeal of a traveler. I will call monster. Okay, it's sinister sharpen. So what's this? It is swarm. Good, good. All right, and I've got robbing goblin. So basically, I have a way to basically negate his whole strategy. Assuming my direct attack goes through. So that's good. All right, giant germ. Get in. Right, right. Ordeal. Oh, gee, what do you know? I was right. <laughs> Alright, well, we got lucky that he had all monsters here. And, then, you know, because if he mixes it up, honestly, that's a pretty good trap card for him. Ordeal. Alright, so hopefully we discarded a piece of Exodia. But if not, we'll get it on this hit. So, uh, let me guess. Monster? Oh, what do you know? Alright. Say goodbye to Exodia. Robin Goblin, baby. Robin Goblin for the win. That card's so good. Alright, I end my turn, Grandpa. Go ahead. Alright. And on the end phase, I think I'm gonna uh, play uh, Soul Resurrection, so let me just make sure. Oh, Dark Room of Nightmare. Yeah, he's really getting his uh, combos going. Holy crap. Well, we know that's Sinister Serpent, so end phase. I will activate Soul Resurrection, baby. Revive my Exit Cannon that I sent to the grave earlier. Draw. Alright guys, and we did it. We got the combo. So, I summon Z Metal Tank. And now I'll use the Union effect to equip this onto my Exec Cannon just to say I did it. Alright. But that's not all, Grandpa. Now I'll banish one copy each of X, Y, and Z. Alright. It's time, guys. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. Alright. Now I summon the Almighty. XYZ Dragon Cannon, the ace monster of this deck. Oh, that's so cool. XYZ Dragon Cannon. Nice. And we could use its effect, but I'm not going to. 
right now. Uh, let's just attack. All right. All right, giant germ, destroy sinister serpent. All right, you have no cards in your hand, so I don't have to do your game. Dang. All right, we did it, guys. We got out XYZ Dragon Cannon. Nice. All right. Witch attack. Did it without even using Witch of the Black Forest. I really just got it out by uh, getting lucky and drawing it. Also using some of the other combos. So, uh, Foolish Burial, X, X Head Cannon. That was cool. All right, go Hyper Destruction. All right, all right, Grandpa, you're on your last leg. I am my turn. All right. got this one wrapped up so let's go here so I can show you guys how many points we win all right face down all right grandpa I draw let's get rid of a couple of your cards so XYZ dragon cannon by discarding a card I can destroy one of your cards so we'll get rid of this one uh, and we don't know what's in his hand so honestly let's discard this to get rid of this one. Now, another way you could cheese that is since he has only one card in his hand, you can check what it is, like when you have multiple monsters like this. So you could check what giant germ and then call the right one every time. So, yeah, that's pretty good. All right. Yeah, and I'll discard that card. What was it? Oh, a monster card. Okay. So I probably would have guessed right. I probably would have guessed monster, you know. But uh, yeah, go. XYZ Dragon Cannon. All right, Union the Force. Nice, and I got to show off XYZ Dragon Cannon, heck yeah. Oh man, we were that close to leveling up. Leveling up. XYZ Dragon Cannon, heck yeah. All right, guys. Well, let's see what he has to say. Well done, you'll make a great rival for my friends and Yugi. Okay, guys, I think that's gonna do it for this episode. Appreciate you guys joining me. All right, in between episodes, I'm definitely gonna take a look at uh, a lot of our decks since we got some much new cards, as well as being able to.